the death monster, a friend or foe. The word death can send shivers down your spine or make your heart race with anxiety. We've all been there staring at a pile of bills, wondering how we let things get out of control. But here's the good news, you're not alone. Millions of people struggle with debt, and the first step to conquering it is understanding it. Debt in its simplest form is borrowing money that you promise to pay back later, usually with interest. It can be a useful tool when used responsibly, like when you take out a mortgage to buy a home. But debt can quickly turn into a monster, especially when high interest rates and mounting balances starts to feel overwhelming. The key is to take control of your debt before it controls you. In this video of Money Mindset, we'll go through the steps to mastering debt. We'll learn about different types of debt, explore strategies for paying it off, and empower you to take charge of your financial future. It's time to take control of your finances and start building a brighter future. Let's get started. Step one, not all debt is created equal. Let's break down some common types. First, we have credit card debt. This is a dangerous one. Credit cards make it easy to overspend. They often come with high interest rates. Next up are loans. Loans can be used for cars, homes, or personal expenses. Interest rates on loans vary depending on your credit score and the type of loan. Payday loans are like a quick fix with long-term consequences. They have extremely high interest rates. Payday loans can trap you in a cycle of debt. Avoid them at all costs. Finally, we have mortgages. These are used to buy homes. Mortgages typically have lower interest rates than other types of debt. However, they are paid off over a longer period. Understanding the different types of debt is crucial to managing your finances effectively. Step 2. Interest Rates Explained, interest rates are like a fee you pay for borrowing money. They are expressed as a percentage of the amount you owe. Credit card debt often carries the highest interest rates, sometimes over 20%. This means that for every $100 you owe, you could be paying an extra $20 or more each year just in interest. Loan interest rates vary depending on your credit worthiness and the type of loan. Generally, the better your credit score, the lower the interest rate you'll qualify for. Payday loans, as we discussed, have astronomical interest rates, often exceeding 400%. These loans are designed to trap borrowers in a cycle of debt, so it's crucial to avoid them. Mortgages typically have lower interest rates, usually between 4% to 7%, as they are secured by the property itself. Understanding how interest rates work is essential to making informed financial decisions. Step 3. Conquering Debt Snowball versus Avalanche Now that we understand the different types of debt and their interest rates, let's dive into some strategies for paying them off. Two popular methods are the Snowball and the Avalanche methods. The Snowball method focuses on building momentum, by tackling the smallest debts first. You make minimum payments on all your debts and then throw any extra money you have at the smallest debt until it's gone. This approach provides a psychological boost as you quickly see progress and gain motivation to keep going. The avalanche method, on the other hand, prioritizes paying down the debts with the highest interest rates first. This approach saves you money in the long run by minimizing the amount of interest you accrue. Both methods have their pros and cons. So the best approach for you depends on your individual circumstances and personality. Drop in the comment below. I am committed to paying off my debt a step at a time. Step four, your debt inventory. Taking control. It's time to take control of your finances and start your journey toward debt freedom. The first step is to create a comprehensive list of all your debts. Write down the name of each debt, the total amount owed, and the interest rate. Once you have a clear picture of your debt, ask yourself some tough questions. How much debt do you have in total? 
What percentage of your income goes toward debt payments each month? Are your debts holding you back from achieving your financial goals? By honestly assessing your debt situation, you can start making informed decisions about how to manage and ultimately eliminate it. Remember, knowledge is power. Understanding your debt is the first step toward conquering it and building a brighter financial future. Don't miss out on our next episode, where we'll share more practical tips and strategies for reducing your debt and building a solid financial foundation. Subscribe now for money mindset videos.